What up, though, YouTube family? It's your boy, Parent82, back with another video. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Hit that thumbs up for your boy. Leave your comments below. Let me know if y'all appreciate the content that I'm bringing y'all. All right, today, just giving y'all a quick look at these Crimson Tint Air Jordan 1 set to release this Friday. For some reason, they pushed the date up. They were supposed to release on Saturday. So I just wanted to give y'all my quick thoughts on them. It's my first time seeing them in hand, actually. So I'm just going to go over them real quick. As you can see, give y'all a quick 360 on the shoe. Show y'all the outsole. Nah, I like these joints, I ain't going to lie. But just off the bell, it reminds me of two Air Jordan ones that I actually have in my collection. Um, reminds me of the uh, the guava ice joints a little bit with this this light crimson tint that it's called, but it's pretty much the same color scheme as the guava ice in hand. And this black leather, like the basketball type of leather, reminds me of the City of Flight Air Jordan ones. You know what I mean? Um, overall, the shoe is pretty good, man. I ain't gonna lie. Leather's leather's all right right here, but right here up top, real soft, real soft, good leather right here. As you can see by the touch, how soft that leather is. That's that's good, good right there. They did put it on the inside panel for some reason. It's not as soft right here, and plush. It's not soft right here, and it's not really soft right there either. They they do come with the extra set of laces, but this is the right shoe I'm reviewing. I believe they on the left shoe. Um, I don't know if it's too much hype around the shoe. It probably is. So they'll be first come first serve up here. I'm I'm, I'm kind of on the fence. Kind of on the fence. I like them though, but I spent too much money already on shoes, so I might just let these sit. See what's going on. I mean, I know they're not gonna sit, but I I don't absolutely have to have it. I could I could live without them. They're pretty dope. Plus, I got my mind set on some other shoes I want to go back and get anyway. So I got I guess I gotta let these go. But I just wanted to bring you all a a first early look at them real quick before you get a chance to buy them and give y'all my thoughts on them. My first time seeing them in hand. Like I said, they they're actually dope. I'm not gonna lie. But matter of fact, the, uh, the guava ices are in here, so let me uh, give y'all a quick comparison of that. Yep, so right here, as you can see, I got the guava ices. And like I said, the, the color, okay. A, a, little, a little different, okay, it, it is a tad different. This is a little lighter, but it could just be the color combination of that black that's making this stand out more than this but, but yeah guava ice and then you like crimson okay so I guess it is a little different what y'all think I say honestly I think it's because of this it's hitting off the black that it seems like this is lighter because there's no other color to break this up Yeah, it looked like they just mashed up that shoe and the City of Flight Air Jordan 1 to bring you this. But it's dope, though. Let me know in the comments if y'all going to pick these up. Is this a cop, drop, or a Steve Nash pass? Let me know. I'm going to have to pass. I, I have no choice. I said I bought too many shoes, and, and I'm trying to save up for some other shoes I want to get. So I'm being very selective. Very selective this year. But it's a dope shoe. Dope shoe overall. I just wanted to give y'all my my two cents on it and bring y'all a quick review of it. But uh Yeah. That's it, man. Appreciate my good people over here at Puffer Reds for always allowing me to get the early review out to y'all real quick. Um y'all know what we do over here, man. Focus on nothing but the positivity and the sneakers. That's what you came here for. It's your boy Pan82. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace.